Hello everyone, this is Becky here at Aunt Bex Creations and Lisa, Lisa My Eclectic Life, next Monday is doing an assemblage project where we're all going to show up with our assemblage pieces already put together and gessoed so that she can get right to the prompt session. So what you'll need is a base and then random things from your basement, garage, things you find along the street. Um, and like that, Scott found this um, S hook while we were out one day, and I found this button. So those two will be on part of my assemblage. So let's go to the basement and see what else we can find. Okay, I'm down in the basement now, and I was just going to look and see what we can find. There's all kinds of stuff. I don't think I want the stink bug that's walking along there. Um, there's a bunch of these, but they're glass, and I don't really want to put them, you know, they're, oh, oh, it, it's pretty sturdy, it didn't break. But I don't think I want to put this on the assemblage project. So, let's see, what else is here? Um, I'm thinking I might just take some shelves upstairs. So I'm just going to do an overview of the shelves real quick. And that there on the bottom shelf is petrified wood. And then, let's see, what else is down here? Just all kinds of larger pieces. Some of that looks like stuff Scott's working on. But I'm going to take this jar upstairs of seashells. It's a bigger jar. I won't use all of them because I think Adele wants to keep a lot of them. There's, there's seashells Aunt Marietta gathered when she was on vacations. And Adele's put a little nest in here. We'll leave that alone. I'm not going to do that. Isn't that an interesting bottle? I'm not sure what was in it. It's got a ship on the label. Sacriel, perishable, I don't know. Looks pretty cool though. So, that looks like something Scott's working on. See, that's my worries. I'm going to grab something he's working on. But then you've got these tins here. That's possible. So, I'm going to set you guys this down and periodically turn it on and show you what I'm adding to the pile.
This is can number two. Look at this piece of wire. All right, let's raid in Uncle Jesse's garage. I don't want to use any glass. Those look like punch outs from a electrical box. I bet I can use those. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. I better not use that. That looks like something important to a clock that might be still laying around somewhere. So, all right, let's see where can I set you up? So, let's see. See, we've not been through all of those boxes and things under there, and I know a big black snake lives in here. So, yeah. I don't think I want to uh, dig through all that stuff. There are some jars on top here. Maybe I can just set you guys up here. And we'll go from there. All right, be back in a few. All right. All right, guys, hang on. Ooh. I brought the stuff from the garage in the basement up and the shells, and then I thought we could pull some things out of this drawer, too. There's an old measuring tape, probably won't use that. But look at this old buckle. I could glue that down. I think this belongs over here. So we'll add that. Let's 
see what else is in here. Something that's circular shaped. That would glue down good. Look at these old glasses. I bet those belong to uh, Aunt Marietta and Scott's mom's um, grand, yeah, sister, mother, I don't know. There's some nice old scissors. It says they're from the Bell system. Look, a girdle holder. That's going on it. So, oh, look at that. That looks like it's got a screwdriver on the end. I wonder if it goes for the sewing machine. But look at all the buttons. Look at all those buttons. There's an old paper clip. I might use that. So I'm going to dig through this. Whatever I find, I'll add with that. I'm going to clean it up good, let it dry, and I will be back at 7 o'clock tonight for my live, and we're going to construct this into my assemblage piece, and um, I'll just get it all glued down tonight, and then I'll give it 24 hours or so to cure the glue out, because it's going to take a while for that E6000 to set up good, and that's my idea of getting my head start for next Monday night with Lisa. That's what we're going to do is a, an assemblage piece from the basement and the garage. So come see how I put this together tonight and take care.